What's up everybody, Chana D, your Techno Dad here. We've got a short video for you today. I got my center channel speaker, the Klipsch RP250C. So we're gonna install that and do some cool sound isolation and decoupling. You don't know what that means? We'll find out right after the jump. So I'm super stoked to get on with my home theater upgrade upgrading pretty much all my speakers here. Just put in the new surround sound speakers. You guys might have seen that in the last video. Now it's time for the center channel. Got a bigger, wider, beefier center channel with dual five and a quarter inch drivers. So the box is downstairs in the studio. So let's go down there and unbox it. Another huge port there. Got your plus and minus connections here. Nice, beautiful ebony finish here. It's quality stuff. Got the dual logo, so if you want to keep it with or without the um, grill, you're good to do that. This looks awesome. I can't wait to get it set up. So I'm going to go upstairs and start moving things around because this is a lot wider than the center channel I have now. And uh, yeah, so let's go upstairs and I'll start doing that. My wife's going to be watching TV, so I'll probably have to just B-roll it and uh, do the audio later. Cool. So it's been a couple of days now and we've watched a few movies, watched a good amount of TV, and even my wife said the first thing she noticed were the vocals, clear, crisp, and they stood out a little bit more. So all in all, this upgrade to the 250C definitely is a huge bonus. The one thing I did notice is when I cranked it, I would get some rattling from the glass that it's sitting on. It actually is noticeable because it wasn't there before. So I was thinking about what can I do to isolate or decouple the speaker from the glass. And I was like, aha, went down to my music studio and checked out what I've got sitting underneath my studio monitors. And what do I have there? I've got a pair of Auralux mopeds. So I went ahead and bought a pair of those. I think they're about $30, a little less than $30 on Amazon. All the vibrations from the speakers get absorbed through the foam and that vibration does not interact with the shelf. So my thinking is it should work great for the center channel speaker as well. So here's what I'm talking about. They come in two pairs actually for two speakers. So you get four of these things. So you can make a level or you can make a four degree incline or decline or an eight degree incline or decline. Considering our center speaker is not at ear level, I'm going to go ahead and try the four degree incline. Let's do it. So I got the Orlux foam underneath the speaker. Yeah, it doesn't look the greatest, but I actually just rewatched a scene in 
John Wick where they're shooting up in like a nightclub or something like that. And there's a lot of loud gunfire coming from the center channel and that was originally what was kind of vibrating the glass that the speaker's sitting on. So now I just rewatched it and it's just awesome. There's no more glass vibration and everything's a bit louder because now the center channel is angled up by four degrees, just ever so slightly. Let's go to some B-roll of me sitting on the couch, looking right at the speaker, and now it's looking right at us. So it's now, I think at the perfect level, I think eight degree incline would have just been a little too much. But this four degrees, perfect. It sounds great, no vibration, it's all good in the hood. So I would recommend this. This little $30 purchase would help your sound system out greatly. If your center channel speaker is sitting on a shelf, whether it's wood, glass, metal, whatever, put some of this foam underneath it, you'll get rid of any kind of vibrations. And this is also great if you want to add maybe four degrees down, eight degrees down, if your speaker is higher than your listening area. If your speaker is lower than your listening areas, as in our cases, go with the four degree incline or eight degree, it all depends on your room and how far away your couch is and all that kind of stuff. So. That's it for this video today. If you liked it, go ahead and smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It should be the button in the center of the screen there. And once again, my name is Chana D. I'm your techno dad, and I'll see you next time.